Hey guys, in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a quick little daytime to date night look for you guys. So if you guys are new, welcome. Make sure you hit subscribe and let's jump right into this transformation. So this is my typical daytime look. It's slightly put together, but nothing over the top or glam. So we're gonna transform this for date night. So I'm starting with this Jaclyn Hill palette. I'm gonna take a fluffy brush. This one is from Crown Brushes. And I'm just gonna start buffing in some warm brown and orangey shades into my crease just to really warm things up and give it a little more definition. And I decided I was gonna upgrade my lashes, so those went next. <laughs> So next I'm gonna do another fluffy brush with a darker shade on the outer corner. I really like to use fluffy brushes and just kind of airbrush like this to get a wash of color without it looking too drastic. I'm just gonna hit under my brow bone with a little bit of off-white matte shadow to clean things up and then really just blend everything out really, really well. So I love these Stila Magnificent Metal Shadows. I know this shade is called Stormy Something. I will have all the products I mention or use down in the description bar on YouTube so you guys can find them down there. But these are just really fun liquid shadows that pack a ton of glitter, a ton of glam, and they're an easy addition to any look to make it a little bit more elevated. I let those dry for just a second so they don't crease. And I decided to deepen up the outer V with that dark shade just a little bit more. So next I'm going in with a liquid liner. This is the Stila Stay All Day Black Liner. This is my favorite for everyday wind liner. It's quick, it's easy, it's super black, it doesn't smudge. And I find that doing a little wing is a really easy way to upgrade a day look to nighttime. So I'm gonna throw on some lashes. These are from Dodo Lashes. These are the most affordable mink lashes I've ever used in my life. I have a discount code down below too so you guys can save even more money, but they're like under 10 bucks and I get multiple uses out of them and look how beautiful these lashes are. I'm using that Tarte Lash Applicator tool to get them on and just kind of making sure they're in place and giving them a little squeeze to make sure they're on. But these lashes, like, Come on, how beautiful are they? They're so fluffy and glam and beautiful. Next, I'm gonna go in with highbrow and I use this on my waterline to just brighten up my eyes and make them look a little bit bigger. And then I'm going to use some Bad Gal Bang mascara from Benefit also just to blend my lashes with my falsies. I'm going in with the Hello Flawless Benefit Powder Foundation just to touch up my face. I don't wanna add any more creams and risk anything looking cakey, so I'm just gonna go in with some powder to give a little bit of coverage and touch things up and take away any shine. Next, I'm going in with Give Me Sun Bronzer from MAC just to warm up my skin, and then I'm gonna hit it with some California Blush from Benefit just to give it a little bit of rosy color. And then I'm gonna mist my face with the Hangover Spray from Too Faced before applying the Amrezi Highlighter from Anastasia Beverly Hills. The spray will make your skin look less powdery and I find it helps the highlight go on so beautiful. So last step is to hit the bottom lashes with that mascara and then I'm gonna go in with a nude liner. You can do Whirl from MAC is one of my favorites. This is one from NYX and I'm just gonna overline my lips a little bit and throw just a nude gloss on top. This is one of the Kylie Cosmetics glosses. And it's just gonna give us like an effortless glam lip without looking too overdone or too over the top. So for this hair, I am taking it out of this everyday pony and I'm gonna go in first with some dry shampoo just to soak up any oil from the night before. I'm just gonna go around parting my hair, spraying it, and then really working it in with my hands to soak up everything and then brush it through to get things nice and under control. This is the Numi 25 millimeter wand. I love this for doing quick, easy waves or curls. I just wrap sections around it and then hold them in my hand for a few seconds to cool to really lock in the shape. And then I just let it go and it's that easy. I just go around my whole head like this taking sections and wrapping it around. I wait until the hair feels pretty warm and then I let it cool in my hand for a few seconds before letting it go. And then I really just kind of do any extra pieces that need more definition. And then I go in, break it up with my fingers. Sometimes I'll comb through with a brush to give it a more shiny, smooth look. 
And then I'm gonna go in with some hairspray and just really give it a nice spray with some flexible hairspray to lock in the shape. And that's pretty much it for this look. Obviously, I'm not going to date night in the tee I've been wearing all day. I'm changing to this super cute top and I will have that link down below as well. It's from Forever 21 and it's under 10 bucks, so jump on it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. It was just a quick little transformation video for you guys. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, leave me some comments, let me know what you thought. But I think that is all I have for you guys today, so I will talk to you guys in the next video. Yeah.